and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new my name is Jillian and today I have another stocking stuffer gift idea for you guys so I did have you guys vote on what store you guys wanted me to go to next it was between a five below Dollar Tree and Target and Target one so I am currently sitting out in the parking lot so I'm gonna run in and see what I can find for stocking stuffers I'm going to try to do the same thing like I did at Walmart I'm going to try to find stuff from like 50 cents a dollar and then the most five dollars so I will try to look for things that are not over five dollars because I know personally I like to buy really small things for stockings I don't like spending a bunch of money on stockings because we do give big gifts so for stockings I just like to buy like little small things for like a dollar so I'm gonna go to the dollar section and then I'll also go in to like their stocking stuffer um, section they usually have like all the way in the back they usually will have like a wall full of stocking stuffer stuff and then as well as going through the toy aisles and seeing what I can find so let's go ahead and head into Target. So I will be starting off in the Target seller spot showing you guys a few stock and stuffer ideas. So these notepads are really cute. They were only $3 each and they had a few different designs. If your kid likes to draw in color, those are perfect. Also, these were $3 and they're called Imagine Ink. So the ink does not get on anything. It only draws on the pictures. And they also had a few different characters in those. So my kids also really love that. I also really like these play packs. It comes with stickers, crayons, and also a coloring book. Those were a dollar and they had a few different options and they had a larger size. And they also had a few different choices from those. Those were, I believe, $3 also some socks my kids love fuzzy cozy socks so they did range like the regular socks were only a dollar but then the bigger fuzzier socks were about three dollars coloring books is always a really great option those were one dollar and again they had a ton of different characters that you could choose from so i'm just going to show you guys around the dollar spot and show you guys all these different ideas that you can put in your kids stockings <music> This was a really great deal. This was a squishy little diary and it came with a pen and that was $3. I would have thought it would have been $5, but $3 is a really great deal. So if you have a little girl, that is really cute to get them. And like I said, I'm going to just show you guys around the dollar spot. I'm not going to do a voiceover for the entire video. So I will pop in here and there. Also really quickly, these little band-aids are great. If your kids are like mine, my kids love to use band-aids. Even when they don't have a real boo-boo, they love them. So those band-aids are perfect. And then these are the fuzzy socks I was telling you guys about. Those are $3 and then just the regular socks are a dollar. I thought this was so cute this was only a dollar and it is to dress up little stuffed animals so I need to grab some of those for my kids I thought that was a really great deal for a dollar and then these little taxis and toy trucks they had a few different options in those as well they also had some tissues my kids go through tissues like crazy they're always asking me for tissues so that's a great stock and stuffer and then balls if you guys have a little baby that is perfect and also these light up little wands I did get one of those for Madison she loves those and also I really love these these are for like on the go so if you guys are traveling that's perfect to take to travel with you to keep your little one occupied they had a few for them just to play with and also ones that you can play games and now moving on from the dollar spot, I'm going around the store and showing you guys these crayons and markers were in clearance for $1.98, I believe, which is a really great deal. Also, these Peppa Pig little toys, the prize box toys, they were on clearance as well. I got one of those for Madison because she's obsessed with Peppa Pig. And then now I'm all the way in the back of Target. They have a wall that's just dedicated to a bunch of stocking stuffers. So you can find so many different options. The prices do range. Like I said, I tried to show you guys things that did not go over $5.00. So everything I'm showing you guys is between like 50 cents and up to $5. <music> So I've 
never seen these. I thought it was really cool. It's by Crayola and they are whipped soaps and they had about three or four different colors to choose from. They also had slime. I don't think I would get my kids the slime, but they did have slime. I thought that was cool. And then they also had some body scrubs. So they had a bunch of different bath stuff with toys and also bath bombs and scrubs, stuff like that. They also had this set with crayons. I thought it was really cute. And also this frozen two bath bombs. And some of the bath bombs did come with like a little prize in the middle, which is really cute. So once it is all done in the bath, they will have a little toy to play with. stocking stuff for aisle and i am now just in the railway toy aisle i'm just going around looking for toys that range from like 50 cents to five dollars the most and showing you guys a bunch of things that i thought were cute and great options for your little ones stick bots my son loves stick bots so if your kids love them they did have a few different options for those toys as far as the surprise one that i just showed you guys they only had one left at my target but like i said they did have a few other stick box toys also if you guys have kids who are in fortnite they did have a few different options for fortnite toys as well i wanted to show you guys these cars i did show you guys these at walmart but they did not have these options so they had a few more options at target when it came to Disney cars. I also want to mention to you guys that a lot of things that I was showing you guys were on clearance or on sales. So they might have originally been more than $5, but they are currently on sale or on clearance. So right now it is a great time to go to Target or Walmart or any stores and see what sales they have. Specifically Target, I did see they had a lot of sales on a lot of their toys. And I thought this was really cute. So if your kids have any Barbies, these were just like little dress up outfits and also little figurines that you can play with the Barbies. And those were $4.99 each and they did have a few different options to choose from. So these cars, for example, are originally $6, but they were on clearance for $4.49. So this is what I'm talking about. A lot of things I showed you guys were over $5, but they are currently on clearance. So if your kids are in to these little surprise bags, toy boxes, definitely check out Target. They had a lot more options than Walmart did. I'm showing you guys all of these. These were all by Disney. And right here, there was at least 12 different options that you guys can choose from. So I am now back in the car from running in to Target. They did have a lot of really cute things for stock and stuffers for really great prices. They also have a ton of toys right now on like sale and on clearance. I didn't share any of those because this was specifically only for stock and stuffers and I was trying not to go over like $5 um, little gifts. So if it is something that you guys are interested in, me taking you guys back to Target and showing you guys some really great Christmas gift ideas for kids, let me know in the comments because like I said, when I went to the toy aisle, they had a ton of things that were on sale and on clearance. I thought were really great deals. So just give this video a thumbs up and let me know if you guys would like me to do a kids gift idea at Target. So this stock and stuffer Target gift idea is only going to be for kids. I didn't show anything for adults. So hopefully you guys still enjoy it. If you guys have not already, please subscribe 
YouTube, I would love to have you join my YouTube family and also turn on your notification bell so you don't miss out on any of my future videos that I do plan on uploading. My upload schedule is usually Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sundays, but I am trying to upload a few extra videos because I'm not sure, but I might do Vlogmas. I've done it the past two years, um, so I'm thinking about doing it again this year, so I'm just trying to get myself ready just in case I decide to do that. So if you have a notification bell on, it'll notify you anytime I do upload a new video. As always, thank you so much for watching today's video. I love you guys, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.